Hey y'all, we've had several people email in and ask us about subscription plugins. Let's talk about it. Hey, so I want to go a little deeper today into what it looks like to actually bring in plugins into your WordPress website to help you gain subscribers. We'll talk about either maybe external stuff like working with Constant Contacts or MailChimp, third-party providers like that, or just simply harvesting email addresses. Let's get it started. Okay, so there could be several reasons why you want to be harvesting email addresses, right? Maybe you want to send out a monthly newsletter or a weekly newsletter. You want to advertise your sales or, or talk about your latest blog post that you've written. And there are several different ways that you can do that. So I'm going to walk you through the fastest way to do it. Did you know, check this out, did you know that you can go whoop, to the end of your domain name, if you're on a WordPress website, right? You can go to the end of your domain name and type in a forward slash and type in the word feed. Did you know that hidden behind here, naturally, is your RSS feed or your feed burner feed. This basically has a running list of all the different blog posts that you've written on your website. And it has the ability right here to subscribe now for people to click on that and automatically get a notification um, whenever you publish something in your posts. How cool is this? The only downside of this is you actually don't get to harvest their email address. This just allows them to quickly get a notification as soon as you uh, blog. But the great thing about this is, is you don't have to do the extra step of trying to notify people that you've already blogged, right? So all you would do is create a link somewhere on your website that says subscribe now or subscribe here and then you would type and then you would link it to this link whatever your domain name is forward slash feed and that would take them to this screen so that they can click that button and actually uh, um, choose their different options of how they want to be notified of your newest blog posts right so that's the easiest way to do this the second easiest way to do this is to let's see is to go ahead and maybe just create some sort of a contact form right you can use contact 7 um, that's a free plugin that you can use to make a form like this and just have a spot for name, email, and instead of saying submit, change the wording to say subscribe, right? And then all of a sudden now you get their email in your inbox and you can add it to whatever list you want and you can connect with them and start building that database of email addresses. Another amazingly fast way to do it is if you're using some sort of a third party service like um, MailChimp. That's one that you can use. Uh, Constant Contacts, that's another one. Aweber, there's a plethora of different email services you can use out there. Some are free, up to a certain amount of users, and then it's an inexpensive price and so forth. But the great thing about these types of services being so popular is that they all have their own plugins for WordPress. MailChimp has one that can totally create this um, list right here where they fill in everything, maybe even choose what list they want to uh, subscribe to and click subscribe and automatically from your website their email drops into that um, list over on that service and you're able to harvest that email and never have to manually enter it again. Now every time you log into MailChimp, their email address is already there and you can be blasting them out. Same thing happens for Constant Contacts. They have an official plugin as well. And I believe even Aweber has some that you can get in there and manipulate and figure out how to connect uh, your Aweber account. Okay, so super cool there. Um, and then probably the, the the craziest way to do it would be to have and and still you're you're able to do it this way is to come to plugins click add new remember that all of these links are going to be in the description box below I'm going to put a, a link there click on that go to the blog article I've got all of this written out for you with links easy links to get you to everything I'm talking about here so if I'm moving too quickly don't worry press pause click on the link below and you can read the blog article Here's some options though that are free with possible pro versions. Uh, you can pay a little bit more and get some cool other features, but out of the box, these are free. This newsletter here has been downloaded over a million times, has great reviews. MailPoet, even though they did get pinged a few months ago for some sort of security breach, I'm pretty sure they've gotten that fixed all up. They've been downloaded over three million times and have phenomenal reviews. So look into installing either one of those and then directly 
off your website, you can send newsletters um, to folks, letting them know that you've written new blog posts, and their email addresses will be sitting here ready to be harvested either by an export situation or just a beautiful database of all their emails and names. So amazing resources for you. One of the major reasons why you need to be doing this is because you need to start collecting people who are interested in you so that you can notify them of great opportunities or great ways of networking. Super, super important to allow people who love what you're doing to stay connected with you. And one other quick thing before I run, I do want to tell you that whenever you install these, obviously you know I've told you before to be watching for the reviews and be sure that they've been updated recently, so you definitely want to keep your eye on any of these options that might be here available for you to use. But when you install them, I want you to be sure that you walk through all of the customization right that's that's available for you what you don't want to do is just install it and think well now what do I do and I don't know how to use it because there are just too many dang options well a lot of these plugins do have a hell of a lot of options you 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 can't just uh, look at this page and panic what a lot of people don't do is just stop for a second and read through these line by line you'll get help some of these authors even have wonderful videos that you can watch really quickly and it'll help you figure out how to set all of this up it's a great resource it's a great free resource but sometimes it just takes a little extra effort to just read check this out I already got my first subscriber hello this is Andrew my son he's five months old just thought I'd let him do a cameo because you guys have been asking me about him. So here he is. Um, this is how easy WordPress is. He's already learning how to build his own WordPress blog. I hope you guys tune in next week. I'll put the link up above so you can subscribe. Hope that helps. Get a bunch of subscribers. Say bye. He doesn't talk yet. All right, bye. Hey, everybody. Videos are a great resource for learning, but there's nothing better than learning in person from WordPress experts. We offer a beginner's course and an advanced track that can teach you everything you want to know about WordPress. Our classes start soon, so head over to webtegrity.com and register today.